I had to close the doors. So, hey guys, how are you? Um, we're in the art room, obviously, and I just wanted to bring you a short, quick video, um, which I think will happen monthly. We are gonna try something um, inspired by some of the beauty channels, beauty news particularly. So the ladies over there do something called Project Pan, where they try to use up their makeup, hit pan in the bottom of the palettes, um, use it what they have, um, and I find that interesting and intriguing. Call it what you will. It's been tried across different YouTube communities in the past, um, but I like the idea of Project Pan, using up what we have, um, trying things that have been sitting in the art room that we acquired, and then, because we thought they were interesting and then just didn't use. Um, <laughs> unlike the rest of you, I've got some of that despite all the purging. So I am gonna start with paint. That's the easy one, acrylic paint. So I've got a bunch of these old Dina Wakely tubes, and some of these are so old that they're gelling in the tube, drying up basically in the tube. So I need to use them up. And um, I've got some deco art paints that are almost empty and a bunch of other stuff. I'm gonna flip the camera around in, the, in a minute. It, we haven't even hit New Year's yet, and I've already managed to use a couple tubes of paint, a roll of washi tape, I'll show you in a minute. And at the end of every month, I'm gonna show you my box of stuff. I'm gonna sort of save the trash, save the empties. Uh, part of what I'm gonna do is not only use things up, but try things that I have in my stash that I haven't tried yet, um, like these. These are Patina Effect pastel paints from um, Prima. I've got two colors. They're still brand new and I don't think I've ever opened them. Um, and I might not like them, but I'm never gonna know that if I just leave them sit in the jar. Hang on one second. So I have my tray out, my giant tray that I used to do acrylic pouring in and I've covered this canvas in a bunch of dark browns and dark blue paints as a base for doing an acrylic pour, a technique that I've been seeing on Paint Your Heart Out's channel. I'll link her channel in the description below. And so this is a good excuse to um, use up some of this paint and try to, a new technique at the same time. Um, acrylic pouring uses up a lot of paint and I've got paint to use up. I've got all these tubes here. I've got all of these here. Um, so we are gonna use them up. That's just the craft paints. I haven't gone through anything else yet. So we're gonna use them up and we're gonna do some acrylic pouring and that'll use up some of the paints. And as I um, use up things, I'm gonna save the empties in my box here, which I'll grab with my foot. So I have my box here, which already has a few things in it. And at the end of the month, we will go through what's in the box, what I've used up what I've used and decide I don't like and I'm gonna get rid of by purging it out to donation or something else. And um, we're gonna just, yeah, use it up. I mean, if you don't use it, it's gonna dry up and you're gonna lose it. So yeah, Project Pan 2020, art supply style. So if you want to uh, follow what I'm doing and get on board with that and share with other people and get ideas about how to use things up or techniques to try with some of those products that are just sitting in the dark corner of your art room, join my Facebook group, A Life of Art and Self-Expression, because we're going to be sharing stuff over there and um, daily projects and what's working, what's not, what we've found that we love, what, that we found that we hate um, or extremely dislike. Hate's a strong word. Um, <laughs> but we're going to use it up, right? And it's not just paint. Markers, pens, pencils, painty papers, bits and pieces. Like, how many things in your art room do you have that are just sitting? They're not doing you any good sitting in a corner, so let's use them up, all right? All right, that's it for today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down below. And um, I will link a few channels for you down in the description that you can watch to get a better idea of where I got my inspiration for different things. And uh, yeah, that's it for today. Don't forget to go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys.